All right, today we're going to do a quick video of the infamous uh, Dozy watt meter. Uh, I picked up an old Dozy test center for a song and dance at the Dayton Swap and just now getting around to hooking it up and trying it out and everything works on it. Didn't have to do anything to it, so then we decided to hook it up along with our other watt meters and uh, see what it do so we got the uh, dozy test center and then the uh, bird analyst digital watt meter with a uh, 50 watt slug in it and then we got the uh, MFJ giant watt meter is what I normally uh, use on the bench and uh, we didn't do anything to any of them so as far as I know everything is factory calibrated and the radio we are using is a Galaxy uh, 2547 and it also has a watt meter that I use for basically input SWR that little Tosmatic there and the second one I use for SWR it's got automatic SWR on it so I like it so we're going to key up and we're going to start at the beginning with the uh, Galaxy 2547. It's showing we're keying about, looks like eight and a half watts. Swinging to about 13 or so. And right now we have everything on uh, average, nothing's on peak. And I think this one doesn't even have a peak, the Tosmatic. It's showing 8 watts. Audio, backing up to 7 or 6. Audio. That's the SWR going into a dummy load, but it goes through a couple watt meters. An amp, which isn't on, and uh, all three of these watt meters, all in series. So we're going to look at the infamous Dozy Test Center. A lot of inform bad information about it. Oh, we got it on peak. Let's put it on average. RMS there. It is showing a dead key of just under 6 watts. Audio. Swinging backwards to 5 or so. So what do you think the bird watt meter is going to say? Next in line, if this is saying 6, going backwards on RMS, let's see. 5.5, pretty good. Hello, hello, hello. Swinging backwards to 4.8. Audio, audio. Audio, audio. Pretty darn close to me. Audio. Everybody says to dozy and the magic watts and last we have in line the uh, untouched I bought this one new a few years ago the MFJ giant watt meter on average and look at that it's showing four and a half watts on average but uh it's saying we're swinging to about uh, hello, 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 eight or nine so it's showing positive modulation while the uh, Bird is showing backwards. The dozy is showing backwards. Hello, hello, hello. The uh, radio is showing a little bit forward. Hello, hello. And the Tosmatic is showing backwards. Looks like the Tosmatic is showing the most watts. Uh, probably the dozy in a close second along with the bird. And then the uh, MFJ is the stingy stingiest. Now mind you, this is all on average. So we're going to turn the three uh, watt meters that have peak to peak. We're going to put the uh, dozy on a peak there. And we're going to put the uh, digital bird also on pep. And we're going to push in peak on the MFJ and see what we get. Now I wonder what you think we're going to key at. I always say we should key at the same thing, but some hams think we're going to key at like 3.8 or uh, percent less or something like that. But let's see. 
Ken just under six. Same thing over here on the bird. 5.8. And the MFJ. A little bit over four and a half. And over at the radio and the Tosmatic. Let's see what it does. Hello. Well, the radio doesn't have a peak, so it's going to show the same thing, of course. And same with the Tosmatic. It's still showing backwards because there is no peak. But here we are. The infamous dozy watt meter, right? All the false watts, all the negative press on it. Let's see. Audio. 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 It looks like about 12, maybe 15 at a peak on a whistle. So surely if that's doing 15, the bird's going to be doing like 10, right? Okay, let's see. On peak. 5.8. Audio. 19. Wow. Imagine that. The bird is showing more peak watts than the dozy. Hello, 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 hello. Twelve. Hello, 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 hello. Nineteen. And last, the MFJ, which was showing peak even on average. Hello, 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 hello. It's showing about seventeen. Hello. So, to me, that should hopefully put an end to the myth that a dozy watt meter shows all kind of crazy uh, 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 watts that aren't there, magic watts and all that. I've had uh, only a couple dozies, but I've had probably 20, 30 black cats over, uh, you know, 40 years I've been doing this, and uh, they pretty much read like a peak reading bird does. Dead key is going to be the same, and uh, a peak on a bird or a dozy is going to be the peak on the same as a uh, bird peak reading watt meter and a bird analog watt meter with a meter that has peak would do the same thing hello 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 so hopefully that puts an end to the myth of the dozy watt meter and everybody claiming that uh, it's junk and they put out fake watts bye